All right, so uh, yesterday we trained on uh, moving targets and obstacles in the way, hunting realistic uh, shooting. Today we're going to train two very hard things for a bare bow shooter. Drawing your bow s several seconds in, ad in advance of when you're going to shoot and also drawing your bow and aiming at a position that is then changing afterwards you draw the bow to another position. This is exactly like an elk coming through the woods. You have several shooting lanes. You have to draw the bow before the elk gets to your shooting lane so he doesn't see your movement and so you're ready, but you don't know where he's gonna stop. That's what we're gonna try. I'm gonna position my whole body to make it more hard, hard towards the right because I think the elk is gonna stop there. I'm gonna draw my bow and then have to turn my body towards the target and see if I can do a good shot after s several seconds at full draw and also not having a perfect body position. Let's see if we can do this. I'm gonna go for strong actual draw and expansion and strong shoulder position that's going to be my keywords strong 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 and mind you i'm not in the perfect body position right now for my target let's try Let's go have a look. I think we did fucking great. We shoot, I'm shooting at my uh, point on, which is 32 yards. And I like to train at my point on because then I know where to aim. And the rest is just a question of if I can do my form correctly. We hit right fucking, sorry. We are actually, sorry, I'm fucking sorry. I have to take it off the tripod. If the yellow wasn't broken, I would say we're actually pretty much in the yellow. At least we're touching or close to the yellow. Pretty fucking good shot. It's very hard to draw a bear bow and hold it for several seconds change your position and then still execute a good shot uh, and you have to practice it one of the things you um, it's, it's one of the most realistic ways of shooting in like in the elk woods uh, and hunting in general and one of the things that are hard is that when you draw the bow and hold the bow without a let off uh, on, a, on a traditional bow for that long you really have to fight not creeping in and losing your power and your expansion um, to really have to kind of overdo your power and you build up for that shot. So uh, go try it out, see what you think. See you guys.